with Sonny, Tammy Fitch in their corner against the Taskmaster, Kevin Sullivan, and Paul Mahoney. And this is a matchup that led us to believe that Balls Mahoney returning to the All World Wrestling League may in fact be with the XWA. That wasn't the case. Balls Mahoney sided with Sabu and the All World Wrestling League to go against the XWA. This matchup takes place before the arrival, before the birth of the Extreme Wrestling Alliance. Big time wrestling in the All World Wrestling League. Philadelphia street fight, no rules, capacity. Keep in mind this matchup took place a little over a year ago as now you see Balls Mahoney and Chris Candino fighting on the other side of the arena. Back to the action near the ring. Sullivan and the Sandman. Not an easy job for the referee in this contest. There are no rules, but they're just brawling all over the place. There's a somewhat of a, a dumpster out there filled with a lot of stuff, including furniture, as the Sandman brings a, a, a side table into the ring. Meanwhile, can that does not mean the match is over, but it might be for Balls Mahoney. Chris Candido is not the timekeeper. He's got no business ringing the bell, but this is a Philadelphia street fight. This is the All World Wrestling League. This is what big time wrestling is all about. Throw out the rules for this one. Anything goes. And he just hit him with the kitchen sink. So now I guess everything is the street fight that had the wrestling world talking for months. We bring this footage to you exclusively on Big Time Wrestling. Wow. Come to our live events, buy an ice cold beverage. Might play a factor in the matchup as Balls Mahoney is busted wide open, bleeding profusely, double cokes to the face. Sandman's face covered with coke. And to work on the Taskmaster, Kevin Sullivan. Sullivan, a master inside and outside the ring. Diabolical individual. Meanwhile, inside the ring, Sandman almost with a, a, a three count over Balls Mahoney. Mahoney got the shoulder up. Here's Balls Mahoney with the Nutcracker Sweet. The Nutcracker Sweet, and that could be it. Can he make a cover though? Doesn't look like it. Sandman's got the cane. Sandman's got the cane and he's going to town on Sullivan and Balls. Balls Mahoney. And now he tosses whatever he had to Kevin Sullivan. Candido is out. And Sullivan's got handcuffs. He's handcuffing the Sandman to the top rope. I am positive that's not the first time the Sandman has ever been slapped with cuffs, but this time in a wrestling ring. And he is pretty much taken out of the matchup as Balls Mahoney and Kevin Sullivan can double team on Chris Candido. Here comes Ricky Morton of the Rock and Roll Express. What's he doing out here? And Robert Gibb on this matchup. No! The Rock and Roll Express has turned and double drop kicked Chris Candido. Balls Mahoney now with the pinfall attempt and he got him. The Rock and Roll Express turn 